So, so many people seem to get this so, so wrong. So let me show you what I mean. This is your life. You're born here when you're zero years old and you probably are gonna die between the age of 80 to maybe 85. For the first 10 years of your life, well, you're just a kid. Up until the age of 20, you're a teenager, you're having fun, you're getting educated. From the age of 20 onwards, you have until approximately the age of 65, that's when most people retire. So this massive chunk of your life is your career. Once you get to retirement, you've got 15 or 20 years worth of retirement to remember the years that you were out there making it happen. And those, those years, your retirement years, are pretty much your time to put your feet up as you get a bit older. However, there's such a massive chunk of your life that is your career that it baffles the living shit out of me why people want to spend all this time doing something they do not love. I am absolutely blown away by the amount of people that get up every day and go and do something they don't love. They build a career okay, around something they don't love. 80% of people don't like their jobs. 20% of people do. So for the vast majority of the population, they're spending time doing something for most of their life that they don't love doing. Okay, so most of their life they're doing it and 80% of that, those people are not enjoying it. It's just that doesn't make any sense to me. It drives me mad because I think everybody has an opportunity here to get out and do something that really inspires them and really motivates them. Now, I'm not suggesting for one minute this is a, you know, inspiring and motivating and doing something you love is a part-time type of thing, a lazy type of thing, no. Being successful at anything requires a massive amount of hard work and effort. But to work hard and put a lot of effort into something you really love doing has got to be a better solution than putting effort into something you don't love doing. Your career starts once you leave college or you leave school and you get the opportunity. Now what I find a lot of people say is like, oh, you know, I'm 30 years old now, you know, I'm, I'm, I do this job, I've got this career and to be honest with you, do you know what, I just can't change it. That's rubbish. If you're 30 years old and you don't love what you do, you can reinvent yourself. You can go and learn something new. You can think about what you're passionate about and start a career here. Now, for those of you that are throwing there, well, I've got a mortgage, I've got kids to pay for stuff. What kind of example are you setting for your kids working through a career doing something you just don't love? What is that gonna say to them? Really, what does that say to them? Follow dad's footsteps, follow mum's footsteps and do something you don't love. Go to work every day and work and grind and hustle doing something you're not passionate about. If my kids were to believe that I got up every day to do something I didn't like to do and have to spend most of my life doing it, they'd think I was mad. But you know what? Subliminally, they'd get the message that that's acceptable and you're sending out the same message too. So my advice to you all, from the age of 20 to the age of 65, which is the biggest chunk of your life, 45 years, make sure you do something that matters to you and you put your heart and your soul into it because you will have a much more fulfilling life. It's just as simple as that. Go work on it, guys, and make it happen.